Hey guys, so today we're going to go over what I call my boo-boo kit. It's uh, basically a bunch of stuff for minor injuries or uh, like ingrown toenails is what a lot of it's for, uh, poison ivy, uh, stuff like that. So first off, bag it. I put it in, just some little bag I got from uh, a surplus store specifically for this. just happened to be the right size and it was on sale. So. That's that. Uh, burn dressing for like minor burns, cigarette burns, or touch the barrel with 240 or something like that. Um, slap that on there real quick. I'm good to go. Uh, lots of gauze pads. Kind of a general use thing, you know. Keep stuff covered up, keep stuff from getting in there. There's a Somebody stole it, but I have a roll of medical tape and a roll of electrical tape that I keep in here, too. Uh, I gotta go buy more because, like I said, somebody stole it. Um, this little tool came in like a pedicure kit. It's really good for shoving cotton balls underneath your toenails. For uh, ingrown toenails, keeping them from getting dug into your skin and bleeding all over the place. Uh, toenail clippers, or fingernail clippers. Toenail clippers. I don't need to explain what those are for. These are tweezers. Uh, also good for putting cotton balls underneath toenails, pulling splinters, stuff like that. Uh, a little brush. Came with the kit that had uh, the clippers and other stuff in them, so I just threw it in there because I might need it. Uh, these are what I mostly use for cutting my toenails because we hike a lot and I'm very prone prone to ingrown toenails and that is is not fun so try to cut them straight across and then before a hike I'll put a little piece of uh, cotton ball with uh, triple antibiotic or baxitracin up underneath the, there but we'll get to that later this another thing just came with a pedicure kit I just kind of threw it in there because why not. Uh, lots of moleskin. Again, we hike a lot. So, these get used quite a bit. Uh, these are little corn or uh, bunion or ingrown toenail little pad things. You put whatever's hurting you in the circle and it keeps your, your boot from rubbing up against it. They're pretty handy. I used them a lot on my last deployment. Uh, cotton balls, obviously I've already covered what those are for. Uh, alcohol wipes, disinfecting little cuts and stuff so they don't get infected because in the field things get pretty nasty. And the last thing you want is uh, an infected cut on your finger and cause you to lose your finger because it got infected so bad that they just decided to cut it off. Uh, going through the, the tubes of ointments and whatnot, um, this is like a numbing cream for your toenails it's, it works pretty good uh, I prefer to actually just stop it from being ingrown but it works if you don't have any other choice uh, Benadryl I'm very prone to poison ivy so that's what that's for secondly adjust this uh, triple antibiotic equipment everybody knows what that is uh, knockoff neosporin this is an antifungal cream because uh, I'm also prone to athlete's foot because I wear boots like 16 hours a day or something ridiculous like that. So athlete's foot, jock itch, works for that stuff. Bacitration, kind of the same thing as triple antibiotic equipment. So, and then this new skin stuff. So I would use it for, well, focus, focus. Uh, maybe it's not gonna there. Uh, there we go. I would use it for uh, stuff like ingrown toenails, and I'm cutting it out, and I get part of my skin and it starts bleeding. Just put pressure on it until it stops bleeding, and then put that over the top of it, and it keeps the scab from breaking, so you don't ruin your socks. Well, not really ruin them, but stain them. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't think I covered this. It's just a snooze tin with uh, ibuprofen and Tylenol in it. 
and cotton ball on the lid. And I used to have it on the, uh, the bottom side, but I took it out because I needed it and I didn't have this big one. This is literally just stuff when you buy like supplement pills, glutamine, BCAAs, ZMA, stuff like that. The cotton balls that's in there. It doesn't need to be sterile to go underneath your toenail because it's not that big of a deal. And I also put triple antibiotic ointment on it. So, anyways, guys, uh, let me know what you think. Uh, things I should add, things I don't need. Like that, for example, I don't really need that. Could be an impromptu knife sharpener if I really needed it to be. So, um, like, comment, subscribe. I'm gonna do more videos like this in the future. Let me know things you guys want to see in the comments. Uh, I'm a grunt in the Marine Corps, so anything related to that, you guys want to see loadouts, um, gear, tips, tricks, stuff like that, feel free to ask away. Alright, thanks for watching.